for months I have avoided this challenge because I couldn't find a good reason to put myself through this. But here I am, I am going to attempt the each room is a budget challenge. The first thing I'm going to do is build a medium sized house and then we are going to furnish the house with the challenge. So let me do that first. All right, so I've done a very modern house with a swimming pool on the top. Oh, hold on. They need to be able to get in the pool. They won't be able with that. There we go. But yeah, I've done like a very modern house that I actually quite like. It has two rooms on the second floor. And you know what I love? Look at these windows on the pool. It kind of like gives light, but you cannot see through in the rooms downstairs. And then downstairs he has a living room, a bathroom, and a formal dining room, and a kitchen. That I put all those windows there, but I don't know how I'm going to make that work. So anyway, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to upload this into the gallery. Because at some point I might just furnish it without a challenge. I'll call it Modern Shell Pool Roof. So that's in the gallery if you guys want to mess around with it. And now, let's start the challenge. So I am not going to make it easy for me. I'm going to have a minimum of 500 and a maximum of 20,000, which is a lot of money and quite difficult to spend, I think, in one room. The only thing I will say is I will consider these three corridor areas as one, because otherwise it's going to take me forever to finish this. And actually, I think we are going to start with this, which seems simple, but I don't think it is. So let's do this first. OK, 8,538. 8,538. And I have to spend all money. I also need to choose floors, wallpaper, everything. I would like to keep it modern, but I mean, that will probably depend on how much money I get everywhere else. Let's use this for now. I mean, you know, I barely can put anything in here, really. And I think this one will consider part of the outside area. I have to spend all money. I don't know if I said that. I think the first thing I want to do, I want to change the stairs. I'm feeling the white vibes here, so I think I'm gonna go for for a wooden for a wooden stair instead. Oh, that gave me some money back. Okay, let me go back. Seven six seven four. Okay, I'll do that. Seven six seven four. That's it. So I don't want to, you know, earn money that I don't deserve. Maybe we can do something like this. It looks cool, and this house is full of modern beats no if there was something higher that would look better huh i guess i could add platform like that i don't know how i feel about this but i could do like a sitting area here i'm going to go f with some strong green for the wallpapers i don't know you know what happens if it was up to me i would literally just use white everywhere and it's just not very fun is it I have this corner here. I was thinking there, I probably should try to fit some piece of furniture, like some sort of shelf. All right, I think the best idea was to put like a base, a big base. I just couldn't find anything else. Up here, I want to do a seating area. I need to spend money though, like, okay, well, that's 700. I think it's one of those budgets that you can do a lot, but also it can go very quickly. So I am going to put some basics that I want. I know I want. I want the coat hanger and the umbrellas. And then here, I'm thinking like a modern table, a big mirror, and just lots of clutter. I think that looks very modern and interesting to say the least. <laughs> I must say, I love building without restrictions. Here, maybe we can put like one of these, one of these beautiful wall decorations. And there's the stair, I always, use these ones like they take a lot of space and i feel like i don't know it brings that spanish mediterranean vibe to the builds even when they have nothing to do with that but also they feel a lot of space i just feel it's something that you would see in a mediterranean house i'm thinking some pictures on the walls here and here we could have another rug this would be the perfect size but i know they are not gonna be very nice are they oh maybe like that oh. Oh, so simple. Yeah, this ones look cool. Yeah, I think it's enough for this, for these two entrances. Let's go here and finish up, finish off this area. I'm gonna add some color. I don't feel like this is working for me. All white, it's too, it's too much. Yeah, that's cute, you see, that's cute. A little rug, maybe not that little. Yeah, maybe like a runner like this, makes sense. 
Okay, we still have 2,000 simoleons that we need to spend. I feel like I've had it easy for the first room. Okay, that's a bit much. <laughs> oh yeah, that one. That one looks perfect. Maybe like a hanging plant here. There you go. Yeah, that's nice. What about in this corner? Oh yeah, okay. I think that looks cool. And I would love to have another hanging light here, but something that comes low. Something like this, but a bit higher. Oh, maybe this one with the plant. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, I love this. And I still have 1,490. Okay, maybe expensive painting here. I don't know, this one, pretending that it's like family, for instance. Okay, that's 415, good. Maybe one more bedside table. Maybe we could even do like a full corner here like that. Okay, I have 155 simoleons left. These are 150. <laughs> oh, come on, there's not 155. Let me put this one here. What about a shelf? I would love if I don't have to use the one simoleon stickers, you know? 155. Oh, perfection. Okay, can I use one of these then? Yeah, just a shelf. There we go. Yeah, I like that corner. Looks intentional. I used all the money, all the money. And the shelf is empty, so you guys can fill it up with stuff. Okay, let's keep going. Kitchen, let's do the kitchen. Uh, this scares me. Okay, 7,330. Okay, well, so far it's not that bad. I think the kitchen, I imagine it definitely quite white or light at least. Maybe I will use the Home Chef Hustle tile to give it a little, I don't know, texture. Oh, you see in the kitchen, if I use the ones I like, it's over. I'm going to use these ones for now and see. That's annoying. It's a bit kitchen, but there's not that much usable space. See, we have 2000 left. So I definitely cannot use the expensive fridge and hob. I'm not forgetting the alarm. This is a door, so I feel like I should try to fit like a little table just for breakfast. Like that there, just three chairs. Oh, that's nice. That's a nice breakfast spot. Yeah, I have 800 left. I'm gonna give them an ice cream machine. I literally never give ice cream machines. I leave it with 54 simoleons. Maybe we can put some max here in the corner as well. Like someone forgot them. Very unorganized, this family. Oh yes, the sauces. Very cool. That leaves me with very little money. Four simoleons. Is there anything for four simoleons? I think in Divac there are things for four simoleons. Yeah, all of this is four simoleons. Okay, maybe I don't want to put that. But I'm sure there is something else. Come on. I'm going to have to use the poem on the wall because that is it. I mean, it's kind of impossible otherwise. But that is our finished room. Let's go with... Let's do the bathroom. All right, generate. Oh, the same sort of money, 6,000. That is a lot for this small bathroom. I think I need to use the very expensive tiles. Otherwise, it's going to be difficult. Okay, for the floor, it's a bit much. I wish there was something a bit more simple. I could use this one. Yeah, it's not bad. I feel like the money didn't move. Okay, this is 5,000. Lol. This is... Let's go with some super modern sort of thingy. Thingy. Can put that one there. Okay, you know what? It's not going to be that difficult. I'm such a crier. This is fine. Wow, so basically, I like the very expensive things. And I generally use the very expensive things for my builds, for what I can see. Because this would be like a bathroom that I, that I would normally do. I feel like this is being so simple. I'm disappointing you guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. I really am. But I don't want to cheat. I don't want to pretend that it's been more difficult than it actually has. Like it certainly hasn't been difficult so far. I'm actually kind of loving this build. Well, this is where I will have probably stopped if I was actually building this. But now I have to spend 1,436. I guess I should have put laundry. I mean, I'm still on time. I could put this here, change this here, and put this ones here. Yeah, it feels fuller. And I have 311. That would be perfect for like a basket, for instance. 71 simoleons left. 
This is 60. I'll put it on top of there. I don't know how they're gonna reach that. That keeps me with 11. More toilet paper there. And that leaves me with one, one simoleon. Okay, this, this clothing pile of laundry is one simoleon. So I'm just gonna put it there as if they were just, you know, about to do laundry. And that is all our budget use in a very meaningful way without any pause on the walls. All right, I'm proud of that. I mean, I know, I know it wasn't difficult. Okay, stop bullying me. Okay, let's do the dining room and generate. Okay, 1,206. Now it starts getting difficult. I mean, for just this room, I mean. I guess for here, I will use the same wood that I used here. Oh, 500. Okay, okay, uh, right problems maybe not let's use some of the basics yeah that white is 52 so that is okay fine now we need to use a different wood that will give us some money okay so this is four we are allowed to use four okay well at least i can use this one which is my favorite floor anyway that gave me 336 oh rubbish i really wanted to use a big table I guess, I mean, this is 210. I think 50 is probably as much as we can use for the chairs. This chair is not nice, but it is 30, you know? So that is so cheap. Hopefully there is a big piece of furniture, useless, but cheap. Okay, like this is only 65. So that looks good there. This is 55. Also a nice piece of furniture, cheap. And I think I need some plants to liven this up. Like a big bouquet of flowers with like lemons inside and limes for some reason. Oh, there's so many more things that we could do with this space, honestly. But uh, it is uh, what it is. It's the name of the game. Maybe we can put a rug. Let me see. We have 100 left. But I think the rug from Get Famous is big and cheap. Yes. Yeah, and it can be this one that is quite modern. Yeah, okay. 36 left. We can have one of these things, whatever that is. That leaves us with 11. Maybe a little notebook here in the corner someone forgot. And that leaves me with one simoleon. And I don't think we have any other option but to put the paws hidden behind here. And that is this room done. Oh, I'm kind of annoyed, <laughs> but all right. Okay, this is the living room. We need a big budget for this. Please, 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 big budget. Uh, oh, yes. I mean, it is a huge room. I'm so lucky. I think I'm going to use this floor, of course. And I'm using this wallpaper as well. Ooh, well, I think I want to do like a sitting area here. That looks cozy. I think I want to use these ones from Eco Lifestyle. I've used them before, but they, I really, really like them. I think in terms of modern, these are the best. And then maybe I can use this modern orange. Ooh, is this completely wrong? It might just be, you know, it might just be. I think the rack might make it or kill it, but whatever of these ones is killing it. So bye, let me see this. This one has nice swatches. Okay, maybe we should go for something like that. Yeah. You know what? Yeah, let's go for something like this, like very modern. So it kind of like bring it all together. Like it doesn't need to make sense anymore. You may think that it doesn't bring anything together, but I mean, I cannot hear you. So <laughs> I think we need to try use that TV for sure. I love how I felt like I had a lot of money and now I don't feel like that anymore because I've spent everything there. I guess these were also expensive. They're 150. Okay, be careful. I want to be able to put all the things that are supposed to be in a living room, like a radio, even if it's a cheap one. I mean, they're not supposed to be in the in a living room in a in a real in real life, you know. But in The Sims, that's what I mean. We can put a lamp here as well. There's not a library here, so maybe a piano and some skills. We have not really put any skill, because otherwise, I guess that could be upstairs. But a piano here, definitely. This is expensive but it also takes a nice chunk of space in this corner. And here it would be nice to have a library. I love how in Sims fashion, they're almost the same color. <laughs> Maybe brown. 
Oh, yeah. Yeah, because there's some brown around as well. I have 147 left. I can put this one here and change the color. We've used this before, but we're going to have to use it again. That is 17 simoleons left. Oh, maybe I can use this one. You know, it's kind of like fits that modern vibe there. Two simoleons left. I think we can only use the paws, which can be there and, and there. And we've used all of the money. Meh, you know. I mean, we have good stuff, though. Like, I could have used cheaper things and filled the room up, but I'm not going to start over. I really thought I was going to be able to do more with the money. Anyway, let's do this small bathroom. How much money do you give me? Oh, really? <laughs> 14,600. Okay. I could have used that in the living room downstairs. Okay. All right. All right. Again, let's do some expensive tiles. I know it's very like Mediterranean looking, but if I do this in a more simple swatch, that could work. And then for the wall. Oh God. It's just painful. Oh, okay. I guess that could work. Maybe I can try using one of these. This is 3000. So they can enjoy the light coming from the swimming pool. And I know it's thrown upon to use this toilet in this type of challenge. So I am going to avoid it for now. And I'm going to try not to use it, even though, you know, it will make things much easier. I'll use expensive towels for sure. Okay, I don't have much space. And I still have 6,000. Come on, if I put that other one, it will literally mean I only have left like 2,000. You're just making it difficult. Okay, not you, me. I'm making it difficult for myself. I just want to do the challenge properly, you know? I mean, what's properly? You know, it's a challenge. It's a Sims 4 challenge. You can do whatever you want. Okay, I have 5,000 simoleons. What the hell am I going to do? This is the most expensive rack. And it's only 825. Okay, this one is 900. Wouldn't it make a nice bathroom mat? It does. What a beautiful bathroom mat. I'm thinking maybe I should put like a shelf. Like a big shelf full of expensive things. Why would someone do this? Because someone challenged them? <laughs> I'm literally going for the most expensive thing. Like this 3,000. Oh no, it's a mattress. I'm like this 3,000 handbag. No, it's a mattress. <laughs> <laughs> right oh my god it's the heart bed lol right so this is the next one 650 okay i cannot use this can i so this phone and keys is 550 let's pretend that someone lifted there in the morning when they were about to wash their teeth okay okay i'm getting there guys i'm getting there well that filled that up um i still have 1600 what about a very expensive painting? There's nothing against having paintings in the bathroom. Oh, this 1590, and it's a boat? This actually makes sense to have it in the bathroom. Okay, where can I put you? Should I put you here? Just because there it feels like it might get wet, but here, this is fine. Oh, huh, right. I only have 12 left. You cannot get mad at me. Look what I did here. That's pretty okay. Okay, maybe we can use, yeah, the stone block there that leaves us with four. I'm going to change. I'm going to put another toilet roll just because I don't want to use four of the paws. I don't mind using two for the two simoleons left. We need to use as much money as we can. And I'll put the paws there and there. And this is our hyper expensive bathroom full of things. Okay, main bedroom. Please give me money. Generate three, two, one. Oh, 11. Okay, I feel like it doesn't go from extreme to extreme. I'm going to take this moment to remind you that I also stream on Twitch. If you guys want to follow me, my name is the same and this plain, but with an underscore at the end. And I also have a Spanish channel. ES and displaying if you speak Spanish or want to learn some Spanish so you can follow me there as well. And here I'm thinking a workstation because they don't have a library so or a computer. I need to be careful with the money. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah, that works nicely. And here, for instance, I could actually have some skill as well. I could have a guitar, maybe a plant here. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of plants in the bedrooms. 
This looks pretty though. I know I've used carpet, but am I allowed to still use a rug? Is this frown upon? This kind of works though. I'm leaving that. A rug over a rug. Why not? I still have 5,000 simoleons. So I am looking for things to do. Maybe like a reading corner. I always love a good reading corner, don't I? Oh, maybe we can give them a radio here as well. Like this beautiful vinyl player. Yeah. Oh, on the jewelry book. Nice. Okay, that's 4,000 left. What about a nice bookshelf? They are 1,550, so that definitely helps. It's just I don't think it goes with the vibe of the rest of the furniture. God. Ooh, the modern looks has its own. I forgot about that. Yes. Okay, let me put that one there. And then also, I remember now, it has like a, like a vanity or something. There we go. That's lovely. And this perfect light. Ooh. Let me put this handbag here again. I know we've used it before, but everybody needs more than one expensive handbag. But I still have quite a bit of money. My God. There's a painting in the wall here or, or something. Yeah, this is pleasant. Love that. Maybe some small clutter. This to write. Some books to read. Reading glasses. <laughs> 182. I can put this hair dryer here again. In a different color. 32 simoleons left. Come on. Ooh, yes. Shoes. All done. And that leaves me with two. Allowed to use that. Yeah, okay. So this is the main room. Quite nice, I think. And let's go for the room for... I would say this is for children's or teenagers oh i must have closed the tab let me see there we go five and twenty thousand generate oh my god okay sixteen thousand sixteen thousand four hundred and eighty one there we go i think i'll do a room for for a child for a child but thinking on when they grow up or not change my mind change my mind i'm doing a teenager I've never used this, so I'm going to do like a boho teenager. I've never done like a boho teenager. This is the high school pack, so I'm going to use that. I've never really used that 100%, I think. High school years, probably some of my favorite furniture is here. Let's see what colors we have to work with. Ooh, okay, okay. Oh, there's many. Okay, I think I like this one. It's the most boho one. Boho, boho. And I think we can do some like bold colors maybe this red i really want to use this canopy of light as well i've used this before i i kind of like love this idea why oh because of the light i'll remove the light there we go maybe i shouldn't have chosen this because i have fifteen thousand, so i have a lot of money to spend oh well i did this to myself i think i can use one of these with a fan yeah maybe like that with the stickers okay i am thinking that to use all that money I'm going to put like a nice computer or something where they can just play video games. Maybe the teenager was like a gamer. Yes. I think we need to use two rugs. One for this and one for this. And this is like a, yeah, like a mat for the computer, you know? That's cool. I have 10,000 simoleons to spend. I just don't want to do silly things. Okay, I think this pastel color vibe, I'm liking it as well. I know it's a lot. Okay, that carpet is insanity. I feel like this pink is pinking. I feel like this needs to change now. There we go. That brings different vibes. It's not boho anymore, I know. It's entered the realm of, I don't know, chewing gum. I feel like I need to put very expensive lamps and things. Maybe we can put the plum bob in one side and those ones in the other. Yeah. Is there expensive painting that will make sense here? Yeah, that's cool. That makes sense. It's also expensive. Good. I guess this family were rich because they own a lot of these expensive bags and perfumes. I'm gonna clutter this so much. Like I need to spend all the money. I need to be able to put more things in this room. I think I'm gonna remove this, leave it up for upstairs, have something else here to spend this 3,500 and then I really don't know what to do. Maybe a TV area, you know, to play video games. Ooh, this will be a nice chair to play. It's probably like too close. Maybe like a bookshelf here. 
Oh, now I don't have money. Okay, I'll know how to, what to do. I can get the computer I wanted. Thank you. And I can still pay for a nice shelf. Okay, I still have 900 simoleons. God, me. God, God, God. Maybe we can have some shelves like that. Maybe like this collectible here. I have my favorite cat there. And my other cat here. That leave us with 125. That should be the price of something. Oh, we didn't give her posters, actually. We only gave her that nice painting. Give her. I mean, I'm assuming it's a her, but it might be a boy as well. Because they're into art. Maybe we can put this somewhere. There's not much space. Okay, never mind. It's going to have to be more like this type of poster. Maybe that one there. Okay, five simoleons left. That one there. Yeah! Woohoo! Now, that is a busy room full of things. But I feel we were faithful to the story. And what is left? Just the outside. This part. It'd be nice to have a good amount of money here. So let's do this. Oh, 8,000. Okay. You know, I must say, this has not been that difficult. I hope you are all not disappointed. I feel like we can use this one here as well. And this one here. And probably the same sort of technique for this wall. I want to use most of the money for outside here. <gasps> and here as well. I actually, I left this space here for a for a bin. That's it. I don't think we need anything else there. I definitely want a barbecue. Maybe that one. No, I'm going to put it here. Just because I want to have and the pool stuff there. A couple of lounge chairs. Maybe we can have that in the corner there. And this one's here instead. Okay, that's nice. Let's put a little table here for drinks. Like, that's important. Some decorations here on the wall. I've never used these butterflies. I think this is the moment. They're cheesy, but they're pretty. This is a wall of cuteness. Oh, that reminds me. I need two things for here. I'll hold on. I want to have a bar and I want to have the painting. I've been saving it for this place. How nice will it be to paint here? I don't know what I'm going to have fit the bar. Yeah, I think this needs to go because the bar is going there. Let me turn the lights off and see what type of lighting we do here. Because I feel like this will be a nice place to have some fairy lights. Let me see what I can do. I'm not very good at this. I mean, I'm not very good. I don't know. I've never tried. That might be amazing. Okay, I think I am managing if I do like that. All right, so I managed. I think I still need a couple of more lights. So we can put that candle there, a candle there. And that's it, that's it, that's pretty. Okay, this is cool, come on. I love how this has turned out. Right, I still have 730, so maybe we can put, yeah, these flowers here. That makes sense. Okay, I have 35 left. 35 simoleons, is there anything for 35? There must be. Towels, folded towel. You see, I think this is more realistic to have towels. You know, actually, let me put towels here. Perfection. I've used all the money. I've used all the money. And now I am going to use the bag to put a bit of greenery here. And I am uh, going to be done. So this is it. I've used some debug for the landscaping. I actually really like how the house turned out. Like I love this big window on the front. So just a quick tour of the house. There is an entrance in green and I don't remember the budgets, but I must say I've been quite lucky with all of them. Like on the ground floor, I had plenty of budget for these three areas. And I know some of you might say, no, that's cheating. Say it in the comments. <laughs> if you think that's cheating, next time I'll consider them individual rooms, but I might just try to have one corridor instead of three. This is the kitchen. I love the windows in the kitchen. I mean, I don't dislike the kitchen. I will have done it differently. I still might come to this house and refurbish it as I will have done it, really. This is my least favorite room. It's dark. I had very little money for this. I think this was the most difficult one. And this is the living room and the small bathroom. I had a lot of money for both of the bathrooms. This one and the one upstairs. I think this corner looks nice. I'm not so sure about this. This looks a bit bare, but it is what it is. There's so much going on here. Anyway, on the second floor, there are two rooms. Actually, the rooms are very good. 
if I say so myself. Like, I really like how this turned out. I had plenty of money, so... The bathroom, again, so many things, because I had 16,000 for this one. I think this was the biggest budget. And then the kids or teenager room, I love it. It's full of stuff because I had a lot of budget again, but okay, it turned out well. And then we have a lovely pool area upstairs. I think this is what make the house special. I love what I did with the lights, you know, first time using this type of fairy lights and I think it looks cute. And the house at night, it looks nice as well. So this is it, this is my each room is a budget challenge. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe. Actually comment below, tell me what you think I did right, what you think I did wrong, if you think I cheat. And I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.